And even at Christmas time, I don't know about you guys, but like we, you know, you give gifts out in the neighborhood and we always have a couple extra sitting by the door because someone's going to come by right. to give you a gift. You're yes. like, oh, we didn't have a gift for them. Oh, yeah, we got this for you, right? right. Because you, know. you, you, you do have that reciprocal feeling. And in the ancient world, that was really something. And it didn't matter. Someone may give you a much bigger gift than you could give back. You mm -hmm. still gave a little something back. And I think that's why when we talk about grace, it, th this covenant context comes in, right? God gives us so much in the covenant. He can promise us so much. And, and the amount that we can give back is very small. But there is something that we should give back. That's our promises in the covenant. Whereas yeah. He gives us eternal life, we're going to give Him love and obedience, right? Mm -hmm. Love and obedience are good. It's not eternal life. Mm -hmm. and, and so I think this is a reciprocal gift. Yeah. That The grace is it, like the covenant. It's, it's what comes down to us and we're asked for something in return. That doesn't mean it's not grace. It doesn't take away from grace. No, it doesn't. It's still a gift. It's just we are expected to, to have a part in this relationship. Mm -hmm.